in this video i am going to give you the basic idea about ratio so without wasting any time let's start so what is ratio ratio is basically comparing two or more quantities here i have described two basic characteristics of ratio the one is the quantities which we are going to compare should have same units uh, we can compare this uh, two speed of car or numbers of any candies or fruits or some quantities in cake or in some cooking and the number two is when writing this your order matters so we will describe these two point later go to the next slide here i have given some example so let's try to find what is ratio by discussing this example the here the example is saying that a basket have two types of fruits one is apple and another is orange in the basket it has it contains 12 apples and 8 oranges so we have to find ratio of the number of apples to oranges apples to oranges the ratio is defined by the notation of two dot it is said is to is to sign so we have written apple to orange you have to define apple to orange ratio so here apple is the first term and orange is the second term okay so we'll write the number of apples in the left side of dot and number of orange corresponding to this equation okay apple here the number of apple orange here the number of orange okay so you can write the ratio about this ratio like fraction 12 by 8 <coughs> okay we, we cannot write this ratio by like this 8 by 12 the first term will be numerator and the second term will be denominator <coughs> so we have to simplify this fraction we will divide the numerator and denominator both by the hcf of these two terms so here hcf is 4 we will divide by 4 it will give 3 by 2 so our ratio would be 3 by it is our answer if the question asked us to find the ratio of orange to apple then the solution would be like this orange to apple so we will write the is to sign here write the number of oranges corresponding to the position number of apples corresponding to this position okay then this will give a uh, fraction 8 by 12 like the same previous problem we will divide the both numerator denominator by hcf which is 4 this will give 2 by 3 so our ratio is 2 by 3 so our second point in the first slide which says that when writing ratio order matters so we proved here that when the mm, order changes the ratio is automatically changes we know that 3 by 2 is not same as 2 by 3 so we can say that 3 is to 2 is not same as 2 is to 3 this both is totally different so if the order is changed then the answer will also be changed and if in the question say number of apple is given and the price of orange is given then we cannot compare these two or apples and oranges here the number of apples is given and number of oranges is given so we 
can compare these two in this slide i have discussed what i have written okay so let's 